Now that's the face of every filmmaker before they learn Codex. Raw, ProRes, H.265. Sounds fancy, but they all tell you a story differently. Let's decode it together. So what exactly is a codec? Think of it as a language your camera uses to record video. Your codec decides how much space it will take, how your footage is stored, and how easily you can edit it in your editing softwares. Some codecs are made for speed, while some are made for pure quality. First, the H.264, the everyday hero. This is by far the most common codec you will find. If you are a content creator who posts videos on social media, this codec is for you. So shoot, edit, upload and you're done with H.264. Then comes H.265, the smart saver. As the name suggests, it is an upgraded version of H.264. So what does it do for you? It gives you the same quality but in a much more smaller file size. Efficient, details and great for 4K when you want more out of net. And when you want complete creative freedom, you go wrong. Both Nikon's N-RAW and ProRes RAW lets you record uncompressed data straight from the sensor. That means you have more flexibility in your dynamic range, in your tonal range and a lot of control in your post-production. But do remember, RAW format records bigger file size. So if you're a filmmaker who wants every frame to be cinematic, then RAW is for you. So whatever your story is, quick content, high-end edits, or full-scale films, your codec decides how your camera will speak your vision. And if you think that's all, wait till we talk about Nikon R3D Any, the next big thing that Nikon has come into.